Hi there. Now, in this video, what I'm going to do is show you how we do part two. You might like to have a go at it. I've included part one in case you need to refer back to anything. So, give you a moment just to try this question. When you come back, I'll take you slowly through the work solution, or you might want to fast forward just to check your solution out. Okay? Welcome back then, if you had a go. So, how do we do this? Well, first of all, if a vector is to be perpendicular to both AB and AC, what we need to do is show that the dot product between the vector AD and each one of these comes to zero. It's a basic rule for the scalar product, okay, that you should be familiar with. So, in part one, we found out that the vector AB was minus 1, minus 3, minus 9, and the vector AC was 1, 1, 5. So what I want to do now is just work out what the vector AD is and then dot it with each one of these. Hopefully it'll be 0. So to get AD, let's just put it up here, AD then is O to D minus O to A. So if we subtract our values then We've got 8 minus 2, which is 6, and then we've got 6 minus 2, which is 4, and then 3 minus 5 is minus 2. So that's our vector A to D then. So therefore, if I do AD dotted with the vector A to B, then in the usual way, what we're going to have is 6 times the minus 1, which is going to be minus 6. And then we've got 4 times minus 3, which is minus 12. And then we've got minus 2 times minus 9, which is plus 18. And as hoped, we end up with 0. So that's proved that AD is perpendicular to AB. And if we do much the same again when it comes to AD, dotted with the vector AC. We're going to have 6 times 1, which is 6, 4 times 1, which is 4, and then minus 2 times 5 is minus 10. So again, 0, which is good. So just to summarize, it said, said show that they're perpendicular. So if we just put therefore AD is perpendicular, Okay, otherwise just leaving it without this ending, in my opinion, doesn't show that you've really understood the idea. That it's perpendicular to the vector AB and the vector A to C. Okay?